So suppose that we have some initial velocity, and we always denote initial velocity with a subscript zero and an acceleration. Then we combine the two previous equations. Velocity times time gives us, gives us a distance. One half times acceleration times time squared gives us distance. So if we throw something down a well, uh, at initial velocity, we're actually going to pluck it so it has an initial velocity of two feet per second, and it only falls for 0 0.5 seconds, and it still falls at 32 feet per second per second. But don't forget, we have to square the time. Then two times one half gives us one foot. 32 times 0.5 squared times one half gives us four foot. The well now is five foot deep. And we have combined those two previous equa equations. We just added them together. It's as simple as that. 